What is up guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another Pokemon Go news update video. Today is March 16th, 2018. And yo, first news story of the day has to go to the fact that we finally wished it into existence. We actually have it. Shiny Lugia, the first ever shiny legendary inside of pokemon go is officially confirmed by multiple sources i'm getting my first news story from pokemongohub.net i'm going to have a link to this article in the description but they have confirmed with a couple of people that yeah shiny lugia is a go oh my god shiny lugia inside of pokemon go i just did a video yesterday about the reason why niantic may have chosen lugia to to come back to make his epic return inside of pokemon go and i was like it's the, the move was already in pokemon go they added the move so it could be stronger or whatever they did to the move but i was like how cool would it be if they added a shiny and they fucking did so let's get high we got shiny lugia inside of pokemon go let me know your hype level of this in the comments i'm super hyped for this i'm super hyped for this because this is maybe the start of them actually releasing shiny legendaries inside of pokemon go who knows the next wave of tons of shiny legendaries that we have to catch up on we have to catch up on the birds we have to catch up on the legendary dogs. We have to catch up on even Mewtwo. We gotta catch up on everybody. Lugia being the first shiny legendary boss to come to Pokemon Go is a huge deal. I can't wait to see more and I can't wait to... to <laughs> I'm excited. I'm excited. Let me know if you're excited in the comment section below. Now the second news story is coming from PokemonGoLive.net on their event page on their Pokemon Go Community Day event page. They updated that Bulbasaur during this Pokemon Go Community Day when evolved into Venusaur, Ivysaur, it's going to have the move Frenzy Plant. Now, as you guys know, I'm not too up to date and knowledgeable on the moves. I'm going to leave a link in the description to Pokemon Go's hub breakdown of the move and how it can affect the metagame and whatnot. But th this is huge news because this is going to be another shiny they're going to be adding to the game is the Bulbasaur line. And I can't wait. I'm hoping, fingers crossed I caught one. I fucking missed out on Dratini. So I'm hoping that I'm able to get a shiny Bulbasaur during this Pokemon Go Community Day event and also to get a Venusaur with Frenzy Plant. Hell, I don't even have Ivysaur nor Venusaur registered in my fucking Pokedex. So to that day is just going to be all about Bulbasaur, all about registering them and having them in my Pokedex first and foremost. And then it's going to be about hunting that shiny down, man. Let me know if you're excited on this movie. If you have any breakdown, drop it in the comments. Let's talk about it as well. So the next Pokemon Go news story is coming again from PokemonGoLive.com, Niantic's official blog post website. It says Facebook account linking and logging in updates coming to Pokemon Go. It says good news trainers. We will soon begin rolling out support for account linking with Facebook, along with a simpler sign in process linking Pokemon Go to your Facebook account gives you more options to log in and helps prevent your progress across devices, which is great. It's great. One thing I fear is, is losing my login. I don't even know it. So linking it to my Facebook. Thank you. Thank you. You're doing me a favor. You're doing me a favor. Thank you. Thank you, Niantic. It says, with this change, you'll be able to link your trainer profile to your Facebook and Google accounts. Thank God. And use any of those clientels to access Pokemon Go, for example. Someone who's currently logged in with Pokemon Trainer Club account could link their trainer profile to both their Google and Facebook accounts, and they can use whichever account they prefer going forward to link your trainer profile to a Google or Facebook account, access the settings menu, and the select 
platform you would like to link. Sounds pretty easy. I hope it's not too hard and difficult because I'm one of those motherfuckers that needed to be just spelled out for me and be easy and just click a button. So hopefully it's that easy. They're saying it is, but fingers crossed. It says account linking is especially useful for someone who has registered for Pokemon Go using a Google account that they may not be able to access in the future, such as one associated with work or a university email address. By linking to their Facebook account, they can continue to make progress on their Pokedex and even link a new Google account to the trainer profile, which sounds dope. So that means if you know you lose an email for whatever reason and you can't log into your Pokemon Go through a new device or whatever the case may be, you'd be fine. You could just log into from your Facebook account and then from there, add another Gmail account to that login. So this sounds pretty good. It sounds like a pretty solid and thought about system that when I think about buying a new phone, one thing I think about is how am I gonna get my apps that I purchase? Am I gonna be able to bring them over? Lucky with Google, it is it's fairly easy to bring over the stuff. Sometimes you do lose save data, which is a, it's a headache within itself, but the, the fact that we're gonna be able to transfer save data from Pokemon Go through Facebook and stuff like that, I think is pretty awesome. It says, please note this feature will only be available to trainers age 13 and over. So again, you gotta be over 13. It says, for details about this new feature, visit the Pokemon Go Help Center. We hope you enjoy this new way to enter the world of Pokemon Go. Sounds pretty good to me, but <laughs> I, I just need to see it in in practice. I'm gonna log my own Facebook account to Pokemon Go as well as my Google accounts. And then when I do get that S9, fingers crossed, when I do get my S9 phone, I'm gonna transfer everything over. So I'm, I'm really, really hoping that it is a seamless process and it's something that I don't have to worry about. Cause I'm the type of person I log in, if it's on my phone, I save my password, I save my login ID, which is probably not the best thing to do because then anyone who has access to my phone has access to these accounts but I, I keep my phone pretty tight close to me if it's not in my home it's it's on me I am that type of person that just needs the simplest way to log in and this looks like that is providing that so kudos to Niantic this is a good one a good one on the belt indeed so that's gonna be all for the Pokemon Go news update video for March 16 2018 let me know if you are out there rating shiny Lugia I know a lot of people said oh this is a break for rating we don't have to rate now because we got Lugia again and this is just for people to re-up on Lugia and for them to distribute this updated patch on this move no Oh, they dropped the shiny on us like always with these Pokemon Go events. They usually have a shiny hidden somewhere, which I think is fucking dope. I think they should just announce it on their blogs now. Like, yo, we're gonna roll out Lugia. Lugia is gonna be shiny as well. Go out, you know, and rate it so we can plan for it I, but i do like the speculation of it as well so let me know your thoughts in the comment section below are you going to be trying to get this shiny lugia let me know your thoughts on this facebook integration and google account integration as well pokemon go community day are you hyped for this the frenzy move or whatever the case may be do you think it's is a valuable move for the bulbasaur family to have let me know all that in the comments. I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter. Like always, you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube. And yes, I've been doing a ton of these Pokemon Go news update videos. The best way to catch them all is with a subscription. So please hit that subscribe button and also hit the like button. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next Pokemon Go news update video.